This question is from the Gate Fix paper 2021, and this is a one mark multiple select type question. This question was asked from the topic quantum statistics. The question is for a finite system of fermions where the density of states increases with energy, the chemical potential option A decreases with temperature, option B increases with temperature, option C doesn't vary with temperature, and the last option option D. Corresponds to the energy where the occupation probability is 0.5. Now, as this is a multiple select type question, it is possible to have multiple options correct for this question. In order to solve this question, we have to have idea about three things. Number one, what is the distribution function or statistics applicable for fermionic system? Number two. What is the dimension of this fermionic system that is one dimensional or two dimensional or three dimensional so that the dose that is density of states increases as a function of energy? And the last thing of number three for the particular dimension of this system, how does the chemical potential vary with the temperature? So, using these three things, we'll solve this problem. Let us go to the solution part. We know fermions are particles with odd multiple of half integer and they follow the Fermi Dirac statistics or Fermi Dirac distribution. The distribution function is given by 1 by e to the power e minus mu by kBt plus 1, where kB is the Boltzmann constant, T is the absolute temperature, E is the energy of the single particle state and mu is the total chemical potential at temperature T. Now it is given in the question, we have to consider a finite system of fermions where dose that is density of states increases with energy. Now we know uh, for the fermionic system, if it is one dimensional, then dose varies as e to the power minus half, that is decreasing function of energy. And for two dimensional fermionic system, it varies as e to the power zero, that is constant. And for three-dimensional fermionic system, the dose varies as e to the power half. So it is an increasing function. So for our case, the fermionic system is a three-dimensional system. The density of states versus energy plot for three-dimensional fermionic system looks like this. So that is the density of states varies as e to the power half. Now at finite temperature, the chemical potential is given by mu t equals to EF0 multiplied with 1 minus pi square by 12 into kb square t square by EF0 whole square plus some higher order terms. Where EF0 is the chemical potential or the Fermi energy of this three dimensional Fermi system at temperature equals to 0 Kelvin. Now, if you see this expression carefully, you will see the chemical potential will decrease as the temperature is increasing. So, among the four options, the option D, that is as temperature increases, the chemical potential energy decreases, is the correct one. Now, we will verify for the other three options. We have already seen the distribution function for a fermionic system, which is also known as the occupation probability of the fermions, is given by 1 by e to the power e minus mu by kBt plus 1. If we plot this occupation probability as a function of energy, then it will be a step function for temperature equals to 0 Kelvin. It means all the fermions will be accommodated at the energy levels less than chemical potential for T is equal to 0 Kelvin. But for T not equal to 0, the plot will be a decreasing function of energy. Physically, this means some fermions will be thermally excited at the energy level higher than chemical potential. Now from the plot, you can clearly see the occupation probability for the energy equals to chemical potential will be half that is 0 
Also, you can directly calculate the occupation probability at E is equal to mu for T not equal to 0 Kelvin. That is 1 by this part will have the value 1 and there is addition plus 1. So it will be 1 by 2 that is 0 0.5. So according to the solutions, option A and the option D are correct for this question. So for this multiple select question, option A and option D are the correct answers among the four options. Thank you.